Imagine you're hauling 80,000 pounds across a 70, slicing through the Rockies, and suddenly, the only thing louder than your engine is your regret. What if your truck had more torque, less downtime, and a brain that basically ran diagnostics before things went wrong? Well, buckle up, because Packard just dropped the early specs for the 2026 MX-13, and folks, this isn't just an upgrade. It's a calculated, fuel-burning chess move in the engine wars. Beat. So, what's really under the hood of the new 2026 Packard MX-13? Let's start with the heart of it all, the powertrain. Early leaks and Packard insiders hint at a 15 to 20 horsepower bump over the current model, with torque rumored to push into the 2,000 pound-foot range for certain configurations. That's not just power. That's pulling a mountain like it's a molehill. Now here's a thought. If your current MX-13 occasionally feels like it sips fuel like a frat kid at a keg party, the 2026 model may surprise you. With a redesigned fuel system and improved combustion timing, we're looking at an estimated 3 to 5% boost in fuel efficiency. That might not sound like much until you realize that's thousands in fuel savings per truck per year. And yes, I know what you're thinking. Fuel savings are great, but what about downtime? Patience, driver. We're getting there. One of the most buzzworthy changes is in the electronic architecture. The MX-13 for 2026 is said to feature advanced predictive diagnostics using machine learning. Think AI meets diesel. It monitors wear patterns, forecasts component lifespan, and warns you before a breakdown hits. It's like having a fortune teller in your ECU. Speaking of surprises, remember that mysterious sensor placement spotted in recent PACCAR test mules? Some analysts believe we might see dynamic valve timing enter the picture. If true, that would push the MX-13 into a whole new tier of performance tuning on the fly, optimizing combustion in real time based on load and terrain. Still with me? Good, because this next part is where things get spicy. Packard isn't just throwing hardware at the wall and seeing what sticks. They're aligning the MX-13 with their proprietary transmission and axle systems, creating a vertically integrated ecosystem. What does that mean for you? Smoother shifting, better load distribution, fewer compatibility issues, and a drivetrain that feels like it's reading your mind. Oh, and get this. Early fleet testers have reported service intervals stretching up to 75,000 miles under certain conditions. That's more miles, fewer pit stops, and, yep, more money in your pocket. Okay, real talk. Do you trust a computer with your engine's future? Because this truck won't just run diagnostics. It'll self-adjust throttle response, boost pressure, and even idle behavior based on driving style. So if you're the kind of driver who babies the throttle or floors it, like you're in a fast and furious audition, this engine knows. Still think diesel innovation is dead? Think again. But here's where we drop the wrench. There's one feature Packard hasn't officially confirmed, but industry insiders keep hinting at. A mild hybrid integration. Wait, what? A hybrid in a heavy-duty diesel? Exactly. Whether it's for auxiliary power or torque fill at low RPMs, the 2026 MX-13 might be the first step toward an electrified support system without losing that diesel backbone. If true, it could be a seismic shift in how we think about long-haul rigs. And if you're thinking, I'll wait for the official launch, you may want to reconsider. Early adopters are already locking in orders through dealer networks, and Packard's initial rollout may be limited due to demand. So here's the question you need to answer. Will you be driving the change or stuck behind it? Subscribe, because the next video? We're breaking down the real-world testing reports, exclusive from a fleet already running pre-production models. And trust me, you won't want to miss what happened during the 12% grade stress test in Utah.